Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... She's great at handling the books. Cloud, I really don't think that'll help. Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his tastes better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Hey, newbie. This delivery isn't due for inspection. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet-looking couple like you. No thanks. But you thought about it, didn't you? <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. Have a safe trip. Come on, you guys. One more round. One more round. Look at this garbage. Can't someone do something about it?
Hey there. We're a pharmacy, but we stock other stuff too. and delectable honey you've ever tasted. Hey, that's not what you promised. The hell with you and your additional charges. Oh, dear. Boss isn't gonna like that. Found this spot years ago. I love coming up here alone. Chaos down there. Who's that? I will go wherever my research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Sir, we are not ready to open at this time. <gasps> what? Aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I've always wanted to dance for a living. Gotta stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands a lifetime ban. Honey girl, there ever was. It's an undisputed truth. Yes, who? It's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever these days. Keep this up. You might want to sign up for this. No, no way. You've lost your marbles, man! My marbles are secure, sir. Tis you who are crazy. I'm so excited huh? to finally see Andrea's show!
Hey there. Are you looking for anything in particular today? Relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty lady. Mm. Oh, to enter or not to enter, that is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? I knew it! Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self-loathing. But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her! <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny! Your Tifa needs you! Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Do come again. They came this close to turning all that organ. I killed to get my hands on the shoes. We're safe for now. I'm not going to be to a ceasefire. I feel so alive watching those crazy bastards wail on each other. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah.
Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on. Can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. About this if you've got any better ideas not really so that's the way it is mm. tifa's been invited into the don's estate huh but to earn such a privilege you must first win the approval of one of the trio right meaning i now know what i must do to save her stay strong tifa help is on the way johnny's coming baby <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. If you're looking to get up to tonight. Roll into a hole and die. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time we'll be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Already recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Tails. Ed, you lose. <sighs> hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. 
Just not quite Cornell's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? That's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Hold it. Best to steer clear of this alley. You may not like the people you find down here, and they may not like you. Do you have any thought to what you want to do next? <laughs> what happened with you know what? It's all taken care of. The only thing is the newbie screwed up got spotted by a tourist. Then you best see to that. Aren't you a curious cat walking dark alleys? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. This once. Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said to you. <laughs> My, what lovely weather we're having! Ugh. Ugh. Huh? And it all leads mm. back to Shira. They're the ones moving the money behind the scenes. And now the There's something downright Ugh. wrong with this place. I guess they're closed right now? Why don't we try looking for another one of the trio? I feel rejuvenated. See the sign out front? All I got is materia.
Thanks, buddy. If you like, you can have it. Yeah, I'm sorry. I've got some business I need to take care of. Oh, the the Everyone's talking about it. Let's tackle it. That's right, I did. Huh? I told you, you're not allowed to see me at work. But there's something I wanted to give you. Delicious materia pops right here. Take a look at it. Right here. <laughs>
I guess they're closed right now. this you wait out here okay then why would i do that no i'm coming with i'm not really sure that you're a man of many talents but talking isn't one of them Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry. But there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. two of you step right up now then what manner of massage do you desire say what 
Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm -hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don Cook. Oh, Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services, then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. <sighs> okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back. And wait. Cloud? <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, did that hurt? No. <laughs> then I'll move on to the base of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flowing. No, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? Is this how you like it? How about this? Or maybe this? <laughs> If that was to your liking, do come again. Right. <sighs> How was it? Huh? You okay? Yeah. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. <laughs> Think you'll make a habit of it? All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm... Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. 
Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's all right, I guess. <laughs> oh, you. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? The doors are now open for tonight's Corneo <laughs> Cup! Please form a line in an orderly fashion! No pushing! <laughs> What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. All right, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. Down, down, down we go. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should. Tonight's grand prize is no less than one million gil! If there's only one way to get it! 
brutalize your opponents thoroughly and utterly, viciously, without mercy, until they vomit blood. Only the most ruthless fighters, the savages still standing here at the end, shall claim the skill and the glory. And now, the long awaited event in which the Blood Star Beast will battle for your amusement, Tim Opponent! Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes! And tonight, Corneo Tom! Wow, this place is really something. You two, wait here until it's time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know? So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well... I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next match, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talking about a bad day? Well, this is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! <laughs> One of Walmart's own, a renowned master of beasts. Will his pet make a meal of our two challengers the fall of their eyes? They've already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon dogs of hell, the sanguine There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this brutal contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! One more shot! Going in. So long. Can you believe it? I don't think anyone saw this coming. What a completely unexpected turn of events. And the winners of our match are Cloud and Eric. That's one win down. Go team! Hmm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. 
But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah, wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. That was some bullshit. And Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Hmm. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semifinals, fresh from their first date with death, I present the lucky couple. We're like unlucky for the rest of us. Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric. Couple my ass! The hell you two trying to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune. Yeah, yeah. Their opponents, reavers in this trapyard, thieves and killers through and through. Two criminal for common criminals, the worst of the worst! Ladies and gentlemen, check their pockets, because they may have already robbed you blind! The most contemptible sons of bitches this side of War Market, Vex Benefits! It 
was two against, uh, I don't remember how many exactly, but a lot. But somehow the winners of our match are... Once again, Cloud and Aaron! That kid's really something. Well, of course he is. I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. <laughs> so have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call him. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall from grace, maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! <sighs> Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Cloud and Aerith, the final match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling tornado cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go! <laughs> we know. We're just as disappointed as you are. But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the play! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts would surprise us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madame M, Cloud and Eric!